Hi kids! Welcome to Teacher Bear Class TV! Today, we're going to discuss about the animal's body parts. In this lesson, you will be able to learn the different body parts of each animal. At the same time, you will be able to learn their functions. Are you ready? Animals have different body parts. Some animals have the same body parts. Other animals have different body parts. Look at the fish, bird, butterfly, and cat. Which parts are the same among them? Which parts are different? Let's study and identify the body parts of a fish. These are the body parts of a fish. Head, eye, mouth, gill, fins, scales, Let's study and identify now the body parts of a bird. These are the body parts of a bird. Head, eye, beak, body, wing, feather, tail, Leg, claw. Let's study and identify the body parts of a butterfly. These are the body parts of a butterfly. Head, eye, antenna, Thorax, leg, forewing, and hindwing. And now, let's study and identify the body parts of a cat. These are the body parts of a cat. Head, Ear, eye, nose, mouth, whisper, body, neck, fur, foreleg, leg, Claw. More animals with their body parts. These are the body parts of a tiger. These are the body parts of a cow. These are the body parts of a pig. These are the body parts of a zebra.
These are the body parts of a horse. These are the body parts of a dog. These are the body parts of an owl. These are the body parts of a chicken. These are the body parts of an ant. These are the body parts of a frog. Functions of the external body parts of the animals are important. Let's read the dialogue of some animals to see how each body part helps them to live and survive. Let's study more of the animals' body parts and their functions. I am a cat. I use my legs for walking and running. My paws are for climbing and grooming. I am a dog. I use my tail for communication. My legs are for running and walking. I am a bird. I use my wings to fly. My beak is for getting food. My feathers help to keep me warm. I use my tail to change direction and balancing. I am a chicken. I have claws for scratching the ground for food. My beak is for getting food. I am a fish. I use my fins for swimming and my gills help me to breathe. My scales cover and protect my body. Animals have common body parts. Each animal has a head, body, and limbs or legs. Look at the heads of some animals. Can you identify each animal by its head? Let's go and say it with me. Are you ready? Dog, elephant, tiger, giraffe, pig, owl, frog, horse. Well done. Most animals have legs and feet. They use them to move around. They walk, run, gallop, and hop. Animals also use their legs and feet for protection and getting food. Birds and foals walk on two legs.
Some animals move on four legs. While others crawl on many legs. The hawk and the eagle have sharp claws on their feet. They use them to catch their prey. The kangaroo uses its strong hind legs to hop. Some animals have special body parts. Let's go and take a look at them. An elephant uses its trunk to get food to eat and drink. The giraffe has a long neck to get young leaves from branches of trees. Birds and foals have beaks to get and eat food. Farm animals have flat teeth to chew grass. The monkey uses its long tail to swing around from one tree to another. The carabao, bull, and goat have horns to protect themselves. The deer and antelope have antlers to protect themselves. To swim in water, fish use their fins. Birds and insects have wings for flying. The octopus, squid, and jellyfish have tentacles that enable them to float or glide in water. Once again, functions of the external body parts of the animals are important. Some animals have special body parts used for movement, food getting, and protection. And circle the body part that belongs to each given animal. To actively participate in this activity, you may write your answer in the comment section. Bird The body part that a bird has is Beak The body part that has an antelope is antler. Elephant. The body part that an elephant has is trunk. Fish. The body part that a fish has is fin. Backs the body part that can do the given movement. 
To actively participate in this activity, you may write your answer in the comment section. Fly The body part that is used for flying is Wings Walk and run The body parts used for walking and running are legs and feet. Swim The body part used for swimming is Thank you for joining me. Let's learn, play, and grow together. Teacher Beth Class TV Subscribe, like, and share. Thank you.